immediately our father took Rama water and went outside. Please, media, can you show us the clip of this thing, please? So that people that was not here will know that we are not joking. A woman said, your husband is here and couldn't talk. Where are you? Shout hallelujah. I didn't ask you. Shout hallelujah. Leave the road. Leave the road. Go, 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 go. Something great is happening in the city of Lagos this June. Our annual Rema Water Program 2024 is here with the team Mighty God. Come and experience salvation, miracles, signs and wonders with unprecedented demonstration of God's power. Date Wednesday 26 to Sunday 30th June 2024. Time 8 a.m. Wednesday and Thursday, 10 p.m. or Friday, all night, and 8 a.m. or Sunday for the grand finale. Prayerfully plan and prepare to be part of this divine encounter. Don't miss it for any reason, as there will be no second edition this year, as we've had in previous years. Ministering God's Messenger, Prophet Chino of favor and able you will take rema water and anoint your father's house i saw something as i'm talking to you now i saw something like before your father left village he had an altar yes sir like yes, sir. like i yes. do he was yes yes sir yes but sir. when he was about relocating to lagos he abandoned it yes date again wednesday 26 to sunday 30th june 2024 at elijah faith assembly behind the sunny market of Aswani Mechanic Village of Osolowe, Isolo, Lagos. For inquiries and accommodation reservation, call or WhatsApp 080 340 9123 or 090 744 96550. Streaming live on Facebook and YouTube at Chinoso and and Elijah Voice TV. Remember, if it is good, it will always be good. Hallelujah! Praise God! Praise God! With excitement, I want to specially invite you to our forthcoming Rema Water Program. Glory be to God! My name is Chino Sofevo Anyebo, the overseer of Elijah Faith Assembly. I am very, very, very excited because it is Rema Water season. Remember, our Rema Water Program used to come up twice every year. But this year, 2024, is going to happen once, and that once is coming up this June with a team, Mighty God. There may be mighty in the land, there may be mighty in your family. Your ancestral pattern can be mighty. The challenges in your life can be mighty. The problem you are going through can be mighty. But when the Almighty appears, every other mighty will bow. God has promised to use this Rema water to glorify his name in your life. This program is coming up on the 26th to 30th of June 2024. I want to assure you that through this forthcoming Rema water program, God, the Almighty, will glorify his name in your life. He will change your situation. He will do something new that has never happened in your life before. Like our previous Rema water program, we had a mind-blowing testimony. A child was born without private part, but by application of Rema water, private part appeared right in the church. Wait, wait, sir, this is the happiness. Uh, and her daughter's name is Dominion. Uh, she opened the private part of this child and saw that the private part was sealed. They went to the first hospital, they referred them to the second hospital, telling them they cannot handle it. But sir, here in this meeting, no! Hey! 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 I told you, as we collect the river water, I keep hearing it. I keep hearing it. That is somebody here, baby, that God wants to create a vagina. Yes. Say it again. Let any woman have a daughter that there is an issue in our private part. Check that private part. Check it. Sir, she said as she took in Rema and applied on this girl, as she started making that declaration, 
she went outside to check her baby girl. Lo and behold, God has created a private part. Everything is over. We have had numerous testimony of what God can use Rema Water to do. I want to specially invite you. This program is coming up on the 26th of June to 30th of June 2024. Remember, like I said before, Rema Water program will happen once this year. And it's going to start on 26th, which is Wednesday, 8 a.m. Not morning and evening session. It's going to be just once. Thursday, 8 a.m. Not morning and evening. It's going to be just once. And on Friday, it's going to be all night by 9 p.m. Then on Sunday, the conclusion of the program, I can't wait to see you there. Because I know that Jesus is the same yesterday, today, today, and forevermore. He's going to glorify his name in your life. I don't know what is going on in your life, but I want to assure you that God has ordained to use Rema water to deliver you. Jesus will do what he says he will do in your life. Get ready for the almighty God to, to work in your life through the Rema water program. God bless you till I meet you there. Remain focused and remain blessed. And remember, it is God. Surely, it will always be God. Church, praise the Lord. My Somebody make a joyful noise unto the Lord. If you know that you serve a living God, the God that gives testimonies, the God that gives signs and wonders, make a joyful noise. Please relax. You're about to say for our ballet. <laughs> Brother, please tell us your name. My name is Uche Matthew Ozi. Our brother is thanking God. This can only be God. Man cannot do this. It can only be the hand of God. It can only be the doings of God. Praise the Lord. Our brother said, um, June, Rema, our Rema Water June. He said that June, she, he was going to the market. He said before you know, something struck his leg and he fell. Immediately he fell. He said all his body changed. They quickly rushed him to the nearby church where they prayed for him, anointed him, but it's like the more they pray, the more whatever that is happening to him became worse. He said from that place, they chartered a bus, chartered a bus from that place down to this arena that night. Every of us, every one of us that was here on that Saturday night will remember this man. He came here half dead. His tongue could not close. His tongue was bulging out from his mouth like spit. as in anybody that sees him will not even want to go close to him. The wife and the people that brought him, they were all sitting outside because they cannot come in because if they are around you, you will not be able to connect to prayers. So they were outside there that night. And there was a pledge that was called at this altar. The wife came forth. He said, I am the wife of that man that is outside lying sick. He said, my husband said, I should come and pledge 50,000 for that pledge that night. Hallelujah. It's, I believe that was what touched the heart of our father. Because our father was still in his office. Immediately he climbed this pulpit. He said, where is that woman that said that the husband is sick lying outside? Hallelujah. Immediately, our father took rubber water and went outside. Please, media, can you show us the clip of this thing, please? So that people that was not here will know that we are not joking. A woman said, your husband is here and couldn't talk. Where are you? Shout hallelujah. I didn't ask you. Shout hallelujah. Leave the road. Leave the road. Go, 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 go. Shukumi 
Pika, Bengali, Guenapa. Hey, we be a bube, we be a bube, bube. Oka kasi mubi a kwageta, nakaya dike te na lugi. Hey, we no solo you no have me. Mary, on kedi, ama na masi a masi a suku. Eka na Jerusalem kuoku, ya bi a meso na kapano. Let's Something is happening to the earth. Camera, walk with us. The earth is closed. The earth is closed. The tongue has gone inside. You are the God who breaks impossibility. In a man, come on to me. Somebody pray in the spirit. Pray in the spirit. Pray in the spirit. Pray the spirit. Pray the spirit.
My name is Carlo Awa. Join him and celebrate Jesus. Our uh, brother is here to thank God for averting sorrow from him that would have made his hand to be amputated. He said where he's working, he's working as a technician and there, there's this particular machine that they use for production that got broken. It's spoiled and as a technician he was called to come and put it in order. Then he said he fixed the engine and he started working. But he said as the machine was working, he discovered that there is a place that needs to be adjusted for proper and easy function of the machine. Then he said he put his hand, normally he said it was not supposed to get his hand, but he don't know what happened. When he put his hand there, the, I believe it should be the fan that did this to him. And he said with the speed of the machine, his hand was supposed to be cut off from that very point but as God may have it he only sustained injury at the hand God preserved his hand that today he's not amputated you know our father will always say if you lose anything but God is the reason why you do not lose everything God preserved him and today he's not amputated can you join me and celebrate this God of a light up my brother I pray for you sorrow and pain will not be a portion the Lord granted divine healing in the name of Jesus Christ, just shall we rise. My name is Abelo John Adore. Can you celebrate Jesus with him? Our brother is here to thank God for healing him from skin infection. Can you celebrate Jesus with him? He said in the month of January, he started noticing some rashes all over his body. Month of January. He went to the hospital to run scan and some first. They told him that it was fungal, that his skin infection. Then they, are, they prescribed some drugs for him and some cream that he should be using to heal the skin infection. But from that January till June, till the day we started our Rema Water program, he said he has been taking these drugs up to no avail. So he said when he came to the Rema Water program on Thursday and picked his own personal deliverance Rema Water, drank of it, he said instantly here at this meeting, he got home and pulled his clothes and he started looking at himself. The rashes have disappeared. Six months of skin infection disappeared immediately. He took Rema water on Thursday morning. And he has returned to thank God for that divine healing. Can you join him and celebrate Jesus wherever you are? Is it written testimony? Yes. She said on saturday when they came after rema water friday night that she went home with rema water so on getting home her daughter gave it to her husband come mm. to drink and wash his face then the husband did and slept at night then in the dream he screamed and jumped up from bed then the daughter came again gave him the second time to drink he said after he threw the rema have the man be sick Okay, you know they hear, you know they talk well, well, you know they hear well, well. Okay, go on, Pastor Jesus. Now, he said, after the daughter gave, her, gave him the second time, he slept again and woke up. And when he woke up this time, just like she said, someone who could not talk started explaining to them what happened to him in the dream. That somebody was coming close to him with to put black thing in his hand. And the person was...
just joining you, you have not missed so much. Before we went on that testimony break, we told you of our own experience and testimonies that we have had through Rema Water. And we also told you that we have a special guest here in our midst, in the person of our father, the overseer of Elijah Faith Assembly, Prophet Chino. So favor Godwin and Nebo is here today to tell us more about Rema Water. Daddy, you're welcome. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Viewers, wherever you're connecting from, I welcome you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Daddy, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for honoring our invitation. Thank you. This morning, Daddy, we want you to tell us and also to tell our viewers what prompts the use of Rema Water. What is your motivation behind Rema Water program in Elijah Faith Assembly? God bless you, sir. Okay, viewers, God bless you. Um, it is not a motivation, but rather God's divine instruction. When God calls any man, he gave him a mantle. He gave him an instruction. When God called Moses, he gave Moses a rod. Like every other man of God you have had, there is always a striking thing God always gives them. So when God called me, he gave me an instruction. He spoke to me in 2008 when this church, Elijah Faith Assembly, started. He said to me, my son, bless water, give to my people, and I, the Lord, will glorify my name. He spoke to me audibly. He said, I should bless water and give to his people. And that becomes a mantle. For example, if you, have, you are good in hearing the story and the testimony of Babalola, late Babalola, the great man of God, that God greatly used, you will discover that I had one story, by the grace of God, I've been opportunity to travel to his own village. I've been able to travel to where he was born. One of the striking things about him is that God also gave him a mantle of water that he will bless water for people. He got to a point, a particular village where he went to minister and he blessed water and the water was not enough. He has to go to their river and bless the river and said, anybody that fed from the river, mm -hmm. there will be a miracle as the Lord spoke to him. Until today, even he has long dead, but until today, people still go to that river. So, Rema water came as God's divine instruction. The man to God gave to me and said, bless water, give to my people, and I, the Lord, will glorify my name. So, that is how Rema water came into existence. God wow, bless you. that is a wonderful insight. Thank wow. you very much, our Father. Thank we you, bless sir. the name of the Lord for how Rema water came. God is indeed a great God. In the book of John, something striking happened in a wedding in Canaan of Galilee. Jesus Christ turned water to wine, symbolically to say that the use of water as a mantle has always happened from the scriptures. Exactly. And we've had a series of Rema Water program. We've had the one titled Glory to Glory. The last one we had is called Prophetic Mandate. Exactly. That is we want to ask you. What is the notion behind this name for this Rema Water coming up in the month of June 2004? Titled Mighty God. Please tell us, Daddy. God bless you. Um, we have had a series of programs where there is different themes for the program. And each of them comes or came as divine instruction. I have never woke up one day and decide to call any program or give any program any title. Most time I will be in the car driving home and he will speak to me that the next program will be tagged this. He will speak to me. This is what most time is as a result of what him, God, want to do in the life of people. Most time the instruction comes as a result of situations around like this forthcoming Rema Water program. God is saying, I want to show that I am the mighty God. That beside me, there is no other. And there is no other mighty around me. That I am the only mighty. That every other powers may be claiming to be mighty, may be making noise. Foundational powers may be making noise. Challenges around you may be making noise. But he wants to prove to every power that he 
is the mighty. That is why he gave me that word. He said, mighty God, which is a theme of their forthcoming Ramata program. So, that is how all the themes have been coming every year. God will say, this is what I want to do. This is what I want to do. Sometimes he say, tell them that the theme of the program is yes. I will ask the Lord, what is mean of yes? He say, I want to seal everything and say yes, because when him God say yes, nobody can say no. So that is how the themes always come by divine instruction and by according to what God wants to do in each season. Because each season there is a move of God. There is something we want to achieve every season. So that is how the topic come into existence. Wow. Hallelujah. God is indeed a great God. Truly is a mighty God. Our phone lines are open now and our callers are already calling in. Thank you so much for calling in and God bless you. We have a first caller on this program. Please, when you call, please tell us your name and where you're calling from. And we'll be here to listen to your testimony. God bless you. We have a first caller this morning. Yeah, good, morning. good morning, Ma. Yeah, good morning. This is Sister Florence Chidi. Sister Florence Chidi, God bless you. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name once again and where you're calling from. Okay. So, I am here to... Uh, good morning and good morning viewers. I am here to share my experience about Rema Water. Uh, uh, as I came to the uh, Legal Fit Assembly in the year 20, uh, 2012, uh, there had been occurrence of untimely death in my father's house, mm. which has been a burden to me. So when I came to the church, I saw how people were testifying concerning their, their, their experience in Rama water. So I joined them to pray. Mm. Not until 2015, during Rama water program, when the uh, uh, overseer, a person of profession, so we were unable, arrived and and went to the altar, straight to the altar concerning the program, where he went to pray for uh, his, uh, the success of a Rema Water program. So as the prayer went on, I found out that the prophet fell under anointing. As the, as the congregation were praying, I felt a touch from someone then i opened my eye because the prophet was pointing to somebody mentioning sister he never mentioned my name so i opened my eye and he asked who was who is a king in my father's house and i answered it was my grandfather who died long ago so god used the servant of god to bring an ugly story of my father's house wow. that it was as a result of the crying of the king that something wrong was wrongly done which has resulted to the occurrence of the untimely death in my father's house so he offered me a bottle of rema water that I got he sent me to my father's house that i should contact my family members and we should pray and use the Rama water to anoint my father's compound that God is about to come on timely death. Mm. So I travel later to my village and has carried out the instruction as he gave. Before this assignment, no man lived up to 50 years, including my father. Mm. That was why it became a pain to me. So as I traveled and this assignment was carried out, I find out that since then, that uh, untimely death came down, that even the last man, my uncle that died, my family lived up to 79 years. Wow. Hallelujah. 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 So it became a, a, a good story to my family. family. My family now believes that God is in the Jafet Assembly. Mm -hmm. So I want to remind the viewers and as many that are watching this moment or listening that another June Rema Water is coming up. Mm -hmm. That as long as they will be able to connect to this program wherever they are, that God will also give them their own testimony and even give them better. Amen. So that is what my own experience. Amen. So thank, you, thank, you. thank you very, very much. Nice 
Thank God you. bless you. Your testimony is permanent in the name of Jesus. Amen. I will declare more testimony upon your family. Amen. Covenant of debt is broken. Amen. Whether financial debt, whether health debt, marital debt, it is broken forever. Amen. More testimony Amen. upon you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you very much, Sister Florence Chidi. You've heard the testimony of our sister of how God did great and mighty things and now the spirit of death was taken away from our family. You can still call us in to share your testimony. We're here listening to what God has done for you. You can lift the faith of others up that God is still in the business of delivering, exactly. of giving miracles. Exactly. Please call us in. We are still here to listen to your testimony. Sister Gift, yes, sister. I remembered a striking testimony one time ago, we already have another, another caller on the line. Please, when you call us in, tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. On the line. Good morning. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. Would you mind to move away from where you're watching from? It is feeding back. Can you move away? If you can hear us, just move away. It is making noise so we can hear you. Go on. Uh, I am Esther Isaiah. I'm calling from Oshodi. Come again. Come again. Hello, ma. Please go ahead. We can hear you. Yes, go ahead, ma. Okay. I'm Esther in reality, calling from Oshodi. It all started 2022. I now located Elijah Faith, 2023. My senior brother, we were rushed to the hospital, General Hospital in Keja. He started spilling out blood and vomiting blood. So we admitted at the hospital for past one month. I now located Elijah Faith during the Rem Water program, which after our father made a declaration. And I bought Rema water to my house. I told my mom about the water. She had to give it to my senior brother. And then I had to give the water to my senior brother. That with faith, it will work for him. Because immediately they discharged us. He was saying to spill out the blood. I said, if you have faith, me which me, I have faith, but I just faith. Mm. Use it. You will see changes in your life. Amen. He said, okay, there is no problem. He took the water. First day, second day, third day, fourth day. He called me very early in the morning that. Esther come, come and see, I thought that. He said he just not feel that. He slept. He wake up. He could not see any blood on him. Oh, hallelujah. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. God is great. He said, yes. He said, okay, let me use the water again and try it the next day. The next day again, he woke up. He could not see any blood again on his clothes. Oh, glory. Man. I may specify yeah. on what God did on my life for my senior brother. Hallelujah. Okay, let me ask you a question. You say your name is Esther, right? Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Your name again? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Your name is Esther, right? Yes, sir. Okay. How many days have your brother been experiencing that blood before application of yes, Rema water? Yes, sir. It started 2022, which we were rushed to the hospital for one month. Did not to the hospital One month. Okay. Then after three days, after three days of applying Rema water, the blood ceased until today. No more blood. Yes, sir. Oh, glory be wow. to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Since Esther, declare your testimony permanent. Amen. Your brother's testimony permanent. Amen. More testimony upon you and your family. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you, Sister Esther. God bless you. We are really happy for that wonderful testimony. Uh, can you hear that somebody was admitted at the hospital for several days oh, wow. and was bleeding out blood for one month? admitted at the hospital just under three days of application of rema water that is the blood say so wake up and say no more blood esther come and see you come and see you no more blood god be the glory to god be the glory Alleluia. to god be the glory Amen. Amen. daddy i also remember the striking testimony in one of our rema water yes a man came 
to Rema Water and he was lying down lifeless. Yes. The wife was really confused in that yes. state. Yes. And I remember that time you were just on the altar. You don't even know what was happening. Yes. And this man anchored faith and just dropped a seed. Yes. And where he was lying down, yes. I don't know the spirit of God ministered the him. Yes, the 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 tongue, tongue. The tongue and God was did it. Just like what our sister said, that someone has been vomiting blood wow. for over how many months. Mm. It is what the Lord of Rema can do. Amen. We have Amen. another caller on the line. Please Amen. tell us where you're calling from and tell us your name. Okay, we missed that caller. So, Daddy, you see, God has always been in the business of doing great and mighty things. You know, you know when God said to me, he said, bless water, give to people, he said, him God we glorify his name so what we see himself. yes okay. what we see is god glorify his name because you know every miracle every testimony yes. is, 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 is all to the glory of god exactly. so whenever god heals is to his glory he wants to take all the glory so god has to be like you say in the business of glorify his name so we give you all the tasks. I think, I think, uh, you know, that testimony is everywhere. That yeah. testimony is everywhere. Sure, but it's actually sure. a but for me, of our mind. <laughs> yeah. if you ask me my own best testimony, okay, it was this last year in my water. Is that a shade with when, us? when that a little girl without vagina. Oh, wow, exactly. Oh, wow. So I far, that. so far, that is my best testimony. Mm. Even in my dreams, I still give that testimony. Yeah. You know, you know, somebody booked for an operation and they are going to create the vagina. Okay, I think we we'll have a call, a caller. Okay, you know, so somebody booked for an operation, the baby, they're supposed to use our operation to, to create that private part. Yeah. But by the application of hmm. Rema water, right in the church. Exactly. It's not as if, you know, God knows how to glorify. It's not as if they went to home. You know, if they have gone home, somebody will have said, maybe the, they the went operation. to hospital yes. and did the operation, and the pastor said, no. But right at the church, God knows how to do his thing. The private part was created. It That's happened in our own very eyes. Yes. I was there yes. and I yes. saw it. Yes. Daddy, please open. Okay. It's like you have another caller. Yes. We have another caller right now. Good morning. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. Please tell us your name and where you are calling us from. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. My name is Good morning. My name is Shamaka and I'm calling from Lagos State. Please can you move a little bit far away from your phone so that we can hear you properly? Please tell us your name once again and where you are calling us from. Good morning. My name is Shamaka and I'm calling from Lagos State. Okay. Please share your experience with us. Everyone is here okay. to listen. I'm testifying on behalf of my elder brother that is staying outside the country. Okay. okay. So during the Rema Water program, I got invited to church by a friend, and then he was out of reach for almost a month. We were calling, nobody knew where he was. Everybody was just looking for a way to contact him. He was not contacting us. We were not contacting him. We called his friends that were outside the country with him. All of them were saying, they were just turning us around. Some were saying he's at home. Some were saying he went out to do some things. But we could not find him actually. So there was a, a, a time we had a Rema program and it was in the evening, the evening section actually. So I came, we prayed, we collected water. And then I had to like, said, I said, since he's not here, I'm going to stand as a point of contact for him. Then I wrote his name on a piece of paper and dropped the Rema water on top of his name. Mm -hmm. Then I started praying. I said, God, wherever he is, I don't know if he's dead or alive, but by the power that is in this Rema water, I want him to locate us back. Mm. Go on, we are here, go on. So it's not, so not up to two days, we found out that my brother called me and said he was arrested by the police and many of his friends, they were all arrested. Then he was the only person that they released and the wow. others were there. They, they, they just, at the, point, at the point of deporting him back to Nigeria, they asked him to go back home freely. Mm. 
Mm. They asked him to go back for Philip after his lawyer went to bring his passport so they can just do the preparation and bring him back to Nigeria. They just told him and the lawyer to just go home, that they should he should just be going home. After he was tired and said he wants to go back to Nigeria, that he's tired of the cell and everything. They just said he should go home when he's supposed to leave night. He lived where he was the next day. They asked him to go home. I want to thank the God of Rema for using Rema to help my brother. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Wow. Chiamata. Okay, go on. You have something to say? Okay, I think we lost that call. Oh. Chiamaka, if you can call us back, please call us back. I want you to uh, tell the viewers and everyone coming to Rema Water Program what you believe God will do in their life. I think we have another call, please. Good morning. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. Good morning, Ma. Good morning. Uh, my name is Ruki. We are calling from Delta State Worry. Wow. wow. You're wow. welcome to Experience Rema Water. Okay. In uh, December, I my sister sent me Rema Water after the program. So, December, I was having one tenant in my um, house. So the tenants refused to move out from the house. He has not paid me rent for like three, two years. Wow. So he refused to move out from the house. He even arrested me. Wow. After I arrested me in your own house. Imagine. Yes, he arrested me. Can you imagine? <laughs> yes, he wrote a petition against me and arrested me in the station. Wow. So after I paid myself, the next day morning, I that same day after I paid myself. I went back to my apartment, to the house. I sprinkled Rema water inside the compound, mm. everywhere in the compound. I was praying that God of Elijah, this man will move. No matter how it is, he's going to move out of this, my house. <laughs> the next day, this man packed, called me back and wow. said, I'm <laughs> out of your house. Oh, I've left your compound for you. Come and take your compound. Oh. Wow. And in fact, everybody in the compound moved out. As I'm talking to you now, a company took this house mm. and paid me for two years. Because of Nera. I sprinkled the Rema water in the compound. Wow. A company took the place and paid me billions of Nera for that mm. apartment that they want to wow. use. Mm. Wow. I just want to uh, give God the glory that the God of uh, Elijah is working for me and my family. Mm. God so bless. Out for my family since I started using Rema water. Wow. I just I just want to give God the glory. Thank you very much. God bless you. Please, what is your encouragement to everyone that will be coming for this Jew Rema water? Hello, sir. What is your prayer and advice to everyone coming for Jew Rema water? To put their faith on Rema Water, it is working. Go, it has go, been working for my family. <laughs> Hallelujah. So God bless Rema you. Rema Water has been like a source of help for my family. I don't play with it. Wow. It has been like a source of help for my family. So I just want to give God the glory. Okay. Rema Water is working. It Amen. is working. It has been working for my too. family. <laughs> God bless you. Your testimony is permanent Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. You have used your mouth to say Rema Water is working. I declare Rema Water will continue working for you and your family in the name of Jesus. Amen. Wow. Wow. God bless you. God bless you. We have another caller, please. God bless you. Thank you very you. much, sir. Hallelujah. I think we lost that color. What, oh. what a powerful Ooh. testimony. What a powerful one. In fact, I almost had good drums on me. <laughs> she read my right oh, Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Your own house. Can you imagine a tenant arresting the, land, the landlady? I'm praying for the tenant. <laughs> Can you imagine that? And and she too, burn herself from police, use rubber water, rubberize everywhere. And the same tenant by himself. Okay, can you see something that a 
applying Rema water in that house affected other tenants. Of course, and of course, what do you Everybody, <laughs> everybody <laughs> just ran out of the compound. We have another caller. He still experienced Rema water. If you are wow. not called in, that means you are missing a lot. Wow. Please call us in to share your testimonies. God yes. is truly doing great and mighty things through yes. Rema water. And yes. people have been sharing their testimony. Wow. That was a wonderful testimony. Can, can, can you remember the, the, the sister that testified before this last caller? that said the brother was arrested abroad mm. and by months they could not communicate exactly, with the brother. I exactly. think we have another caller. We'll talk about that. Good morning. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. Good morning. This is still Sister Chamaka calling. Oh, I was about talking about your testimony. <laughs> Do you want to yes. say something before the line went off? Yes, I had something to Say. Okay. Go on. Okay. Patterning my brother's testimony, I just want to thank God of Rema for using Rema water to save my brother. Okay. Yeah. God bless and you. Now I'm testifying on behalf of myself. Okay. okay. Go on. Uh, okay. Um, last two months ago, February, I traveled to the village for my auntie's wedding. So I had a bot I had two bottles of Rema water in my bag and then the deliverance oil. So when I got to my father's house, I opened immediately I got to the front of my father's house, I opened two the two water, then I started spraying it from the junction down to inside the house and I was praying in my mind that this Rema water will break everything that is going to like stop us from doing anything that is going to make us progress in this house. So and I gave my other brother that was in the village, I gave him the deliverance oil that he should be using it also. I told him how to use it and all. And then I I left the village. Only for me to get back. I was I was having difficulty in in studying. I I did not eat anything that would make my anus blocked, but I could not stool. I was trying to, I used drugs, I could not still do anything. Mm -hmm. So there was a time that you people were on live, so I keyed into the live and I was watching live. So you were saying, if there's any way that somebody is having pain or you're having difficulty or anything, use the Rema water on it. With faith, I took the Rema water from my bag. Then I started using it to wash myself. It was not even up to three minutes that I went back. I, I felt this pain in my stomach, like my intestines were co-joining together. Mm -hmm. Then I ran into the toilet to go and ease myself, only for, me to, only for me to just, just excrete freely without the pain I was wow. feeling for almost yeah. four days. I yeah. could not feel it anymore and I, I just excreted freely after using the Rema water to wash myself. I want to thank God for helping me, for delivering wow. me from that pain. Okay, yes. I want to ask you a question. Are you a member of Elijah Faith Assembly? Yes, sir. Okay, you are a member. Wow. We declare your healing permanent in the name of Jesus. Amen. We declare Amen. your brother's deliverance permanent. The Lord will prosper him in that land. Amen. And he will come Amen. back with a breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. Let's God take another Thank you, sir. God bless you. Let's take another call. Let's take another call. God Let's take. A... Hallelujah. 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 Thank God is truly faithful. Mm, God is. I was. I was about talking about her. You know. You know. Somebody apply Rema water on a written name of her brother. Exactly. Not even picture what this a time. Great face. He, he, she wrote the name on a paper and apply Rema water, and God intervened. Yes. And the brother. Instead of being deported back to Nigeria, mm. he say he say he was arrested with other of his friends. Yeah. Other of his friends were deported back, mm. but him they said with his lawyer. He was even saying, "I want to go home. Oh, I'm tired yeah. of this cell." Yeah. But they said, "You can't go home. Go oh, back wow. to the country." Wow. Can you imagine? Wow. By applying the wow. water on the name, wow. on the name, it's on it's the it's name. That is like you always say, "It yes. is God." It was it's always surely. Yes. We have another caller on the line. Yes. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. <laughs> Go on, please move away from your phone so you can hear us. It's noisy. Hello? 
Move away from what you are using to watch. God bless you. Go on, tell us your name and where you're calling from. I think we lost that call. Okay. Okay, let's take another one. Good morning. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. Hello, good morning. My name is Ruth. I'm from Lagos. God okay. bless you, Sister Ruth. I'm from Lagos. Please go ahead. I want to share my experience with Rema Water ever since I came into a life of faith of family. I came into a life of faith of family. Pain in my stomach and my leg because I had a dislocation on my leg years back 2012 to 2013. Which, when I went to the hospital, to General Hospital, I went from um, x rays and other tests and resulted that I was fine. I was okay, but I was still feeling pain on me. Next to the species, my new cap, precisely the right side, was still system. So my parents were about to take me down to the east to help me do it to make me go. So I was like, what are the repercussions if they are not able to fix this? And they told me, the man in the east said he was going to use his hand to work on it and once the hand begins to work then i'll begin to work and i asked them what if the hand doesn't work they said that i will work and stay at that place not until the hand recovers and i was like no i'm not going anywhere until i'm fine so it became a problem between me and my parents. So I calmed down. I went to church every the Rima Water program that was held 2014 during Rima Water program. I used my Rima Water. I was applying it on my leg. I was taking it in for use, stomach pain, and also for my leg. But the more I take the Rima water, then inside, I felt more pains. And when I apply on my leg, it is the thing. Hallelujah. The last day of the program, which was the Friday before the Thanksgiving, I applied it on my leg very well. And in the church game, my leg stopped pain. And I was like, I was still looking for the pains in my leg. Actually. Oh, wow. Oh, I couldn't find it. Hallelujah. Then I got home. I got home. I told my mom that the pain has hit me. And when this pain starts, once the leg and leg cap shift to the other side, mm. there will be a need for somebody to use what they use in turning Gary to reposition my leg very well. Mm. If I went through pain there. I never told anybody so just within me and my family and to remain with I cannot find such action in wow. my legs. Mm. So I've come to give God all the glory. Wow. And wow. Say, to him that has done this, may his name alone be glorified. Amen. Amen. Please, what is your encouragement to people that have not have access to Rema water? Maybe somebody is watching us right now from the hospital or people with one challenges or the other. Please, what is your encouragement to them? To those that will be attending the Rimmel Water this forthcoming and to every viewers, all I just want them to do is answer their feet on the Rimmel Water because it works. Mm -hmm. And I believe that as they use it, the Lord will glorify is being to their life and the life of their family. Because God has also been doing so in myself and in the life of my family. Amen. God bless you. I declare your testimony permanent. Amen. God's blessings Amen. and favor remain upon you. Amen. In the name Amen. of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Wow. Wow. Amen. What a mighty God we serve. Amen. What a mighty God we serve. Hallelujah. Amen. God is Amen. truly faithful. Indeed. There are testimonies who hear like this. You look as if it's arranged. Mm. You look as if you are just, you know, God is truly faithful. 
God is truly faithful. What he said he will do, he that he will surely do. Yes. Sister, what do you have to say about the testimony? God is indeed a great God. Wow. If Sister Ruth can give this testimony of how God used Rema Water to heal her leg. Nika. I've seen a lot of people wow. when they come to Rema Water program, coming with clutches, and they will leave that clutches here in this yeah. arena. Yeah. Going back home, using their leg, it is what the Lord can do. Sure. God is indeed a great you God. Know, you know, a shifted new car. Yes. They adjusted by the application so of no rainbow water. water. God is really faithful. God it is, is faithful. only orthopedic people that can do that. No. It is she only even God. said if he shifts, she must have, somebody must come to shift it back. If not, she cannot be able to walk or do anything. Can you, can you imagine oh, wow. that? Wow. That, is, that is God now is using Rema water mm. to... Orthopedically <laughs> shifts. <laughs> God is indeed a faithful God. Yes, yes, People of God, yes. what wow. you are hearing mm. is what God has promised. Mm. It is only God we serve that is a God who never lies. Sure. I'm telling you the truth. What God said he will do. Mm. That is what he's going to do. Exactly. We have seen it. Rema water is like, like I was asked before. Rema water is complete God's instruction. Mm. God's mantle. Mm. It's a mandate given to me by God. Mm. Hallelujah. Let's take another caller, please. Good morning. Please tell us where you're calling from and tell us your name. God bless you. Good morning. My name is Kamu Deshiklo. You're welcome. Okay, I'm a member of the Niger State Assembly. I want to say my testimony about Rima Water. Mm. Okay. Because God used that Rima Water to heal me from serious ulcer. Wow. After I want to chop my money. Mm. Mm. I could not say it. How many years did you chop your money? It was one year wow. when I came back from camp. I was having so much for that I didn't even know I had water. Until I was shopping the compound and they asked me to go to the hospital, I said I should do that. So that they asked me if I have water. I said no, I was sure. Why did they ask me that kind of question? I thought it was normal uh, period pain. Because I always have normal period pain that will make me to feel. I always have few weeks. Mm. So I was now doubting that it cannot be water. Me, water came. Mm. Finally, I went to go and do the test. And they said I have water. I was like, I was shocked. I did the treatment, they say it's not serious, I start treatment, I can start eating normal. Mm. But after the treatment, I didn't get myself. In fact, I eat like five times a day, more than five times a day. Mm. I wake up early in the morning, mm. like six o'clock, eat, seven o'clock, I'll eat, ten mm. o'clock, I'm, I'm always feeling hungry. If I don't eat, mm. it's too much to be cleaning me. Mm. I could not taste salad. If they pay me salad, I will eat the money to market to and buy things down. Because I'm always eating. So I got my deliverance, my healing from last year camp. Yeah. When the prophet said we should do dry fasting. I was not hungry. I want to do this dry fasting. How will I do this dry fasting? For me, they have water. And I came with my orish, orish, orish. Like things that I'll be eating, 247. So it's called the altar. But one man said, join this fast. I said, how will I do dry fasting? Please so see. But it was not easy. I did not drink water. I was just have to drive fast for the last year camp. Mm. Then the prophet said, we are going to break the fast with Rema water. Mm. Mm. So we, we did that. And I brought the fast with Rema water. I did it to be dry. That said that I did it. I could not believe it. After the Rema water, I, the symptoms of that water stopped. Mm. Mm. I break the fast with it drain my water around that thing. Mm. But I ate my food, tea and bread, once they say, around that 8 o'clock. Mm. 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 I didn't know that fasting again. I took it that dry fasting again. Mm. And I took tea and bread. All the things that I brought to camp, I took them back home. Mm. Mm. I did not eat all those things that I would be eating if I have water 247. Mm. I just thank God because wow. those who wow. that we Wow. 
Wow. wow. Your healing is permanent Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Affliction will not rise up again. Amen. May the Lord that heal you heal every aspect of your life. Amen. Financially, Amen. spiritually, Amen. your family, may the Lord heal you. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless wow. You. God is truly faithful. Indeed. God is truly faithful. Wow. God heal people. We give God all the glory. We give God all the honor for that healing. Mm -hmm. May his name be glorified. Amen. Maybe you are connected and you are having ulcer. Mm -hmm. I find out that ulcer is one common sickness mm -hmm. now that so many people are suffering from. I so I ulcer. believe every one of you watching, wherever you are watching from, Rema Water Program is another program mm -hmm. that God is going to he use to heal people from ulcer. Mm. God bless you. It's a gift. What do you have to say? What do you have to say concerning this healing, you know, mind-blowing testimonies Daddy, that we are receiving today? Like I said, yes. a lot of these testimonies has been giving me goosebumps of mine. You see this ulcer, I can relate to it. Mm. Okay, it's like we have another color. No, go on, go on. Okay, I can really relate because yes. it has been what I, I had suffered. I also <laughs> I also have suffered. Yeah, wow. So it when she said, uh -huh. eat him, eat him, eat exactly, him. Exactly, yeah. exactly. You <laughs> must eat because if you don't eat the pain. Or even you have to carry your gut. And milk. Yes. In fact, you just keep eating. You can't save. If you are somebody that wants to save up for something, you cannot save because you will always want to bite something. I think we'll, Sandy, we'll come back to that testimony. Please, yes. let's quickly take this call. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. Hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Go on. We are hearing you. Okay, sir. Um, I want to share my testimony. Please tell us your name, sir. My name is Brother Daniel, Daniel Ogunye. Okay. Yes. I want to share my testimony uh, of what to be more what God is doing more what I should do. Mm. I think it's very, 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 very wonderful because uh, where I am living, the compound I'm living, we have about uh, three uh, uh, trees of uh, purple tree. And this tree is Wow, well, the, the line is breaking. Yes, the line is breaking. Please, can you cut and call us back, please? Can you call us back? The line is breaking so we can hear because you are having a wonderful testimony. Yeah. We need to hear it very well. Yes, please. Can you call us back, sir? Call us back immediately. Sorry for that. I think that is network issue. Okay. It's very common around when you have network issues. Yes. But we are ex we're waiting for your testimony. Please yes. call us back and we'll be here to listen to that wonderful testimony. God bless you. Mm. Sister Gidi, you were telling us what God has done for you through Remember. Yes, I want to uh, uh, relate on the altar testimony that our sister shared. As that, the pain of ulcer, uh, if you have not had ulcer, hey, if you are talking about ulcer, you think I, maybe I it's think, just I ulcer. Think, I think the guy is calling or the brother is calling okay. on let's, let's take that striking testimony. Please tell us. I can go ahead now. Okay. I can go ahead now. Yes, yes go ahead, sir. I am, I am Daniel of you. Daniel of you. Daniel of you. Okay. And they were there standing for more than three years without bearing fruits. And at the point, people began to suggest that we should cut them down. Since they cannot bear fruits, then they are male uh, uh, purple trees. Then they cannot bear fruits. But male purple trees usually have flowers. But this one did not have flowers. So uh, I, I told them to leave it. So I think after one day, the Lord permit me to know that with Rima water, something can happen to this uh, purple trees. That was how I now got in the water and applied to do things one after the other. Mm -hmm. I applied them for about two days, about two or three days. Then I left it. Not quite a, a, a month after. We started getting food. Wow. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. And people began to walk. 
You, sir. God bless you. Okay. okay. God bless you. Your testimony is permanent. Amen. God who answered that lady, answer you and your family too. Amen. International opened up upon you and your family. Amen. I declare the hand of God upon your children. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Wow. Wow. God bless you, sir. Bless God bless you, sir. Daddy, that, bless. that was a striking one. Yes. If Rema Water can walk on humans. On, <laughs> on a tree. <laughs> on a tree. And multiply. Uh, That's what the word of God says. So Rema Water now walks on fruit. That is only what God of Rema can do. Wow. 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 There, wow. there are some yeah. testimonies we hear. <laughs> we just sound. They are striking. They are you know, very striking. You know, I remember also a testimony of a woman last time from Abia State who said her crops was not growing. Exactly. She carried one elderly yes. woman. Carry. Okay, we have another call. Yes. <laughs> Good morning. You're welcome to your experience, Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. We are hearing you. Go on. Hello, can you can you remove it? It is I think you put it on the speaker out. It's loud, it's noisy, please. Oh, can we pick the card? Sorry for that. Good morning. You're welcome to Experience Rema Water 2024. Please tell us your name and where you're calling us from. God bless you. My name is Shamad um, Gloria. I'm what? calling from Lagos, God Lagos, God. Nigeria. Okay. Go on. We are hearing you. Go on quickly. Okay. I want to share my testimony concerning what God of Rema did for me and my household. Mm -hmm. So months back, I had this attack. Do so for some years now, my family have been experiencing this recurring death. 
every year, every year, somebody dies in my father's house. Mm. Three years ago, we buried three dead bodies in my father's compound. After we, the prophet prayed for the family. Second year again, we buried my elder sister. It was after that burial that prophet prayed for my siblings and I. Mm. Few months back, which happened to be a fresh year, another year. On my way back from war, I had an arrow. I had this strange thing that within few seconds, I lose consciousness. Mm. And it happened to be the time and period that this barrier often occurred in mm. my father's house. Mm. That season, I lost, I lost consciousness. I don't know, but I lost it all. Mm. Because the pain, within a few seconds, the pain begins to travel down up to my chest region. Mm. And at a point, it was a thing I could in fact, I see the, my breathing feet. My breathing feet. My daughter was running her casket, calling, placing calls, all to no avail. But to God be the glory. Mm. We go through, and somebody asked her to get Rema water. Mm. When she got the Rema water, then I lose consciousness. I don't want, know what was happening again. When she drank the Rema water, there was kind of a touch. Mm. It I see the Rema water, the way I felt when that Rema water dropped, because she said she put my mouth open. Mm. She put my mouth open and she dropped the Rema water three times. Wow. The first one, the second one, and the third one. It was a thing, there was a push mm. where my heart was blocked mm. and the Rama water pushed what was holding it, what was blocking it and causing the breath to see. Mm. It pushed it away. It pushed it. I was feeling it as it was being pushed. Mm. I was feeling it within me as it was being pushed and it was pushed away and I regained consciousness. Wow. I want to thank God. I want to thank God of Rema. Because Jesus. It is, it is, this is how people die. Yes. Within a twinkle of an eye. Mm. Within a twinkle of an eye. If it were not God, I don't know the story my family will be telling today. Wow, mm. God forbid. Of that, um, that experience happens every year. We bury somebody in my father's house. Mm. Every year. It is not just the male, the male pastor, but also my sisters. We have buried two sisters. Oh. My other sister, my younger sister. This happened yearly. So I want to thank God, mm. God of Brema. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. That I am not counted among the dead today. Thank you, that Jesus. That I am living today. Mm. I want Hallelujah. to thank God. Hallelujah. If we not to be God of Brema, I don't know what. I would have done. Hallelujah. I don't know what my family, my Hallelujah. children, where they would be today. Jesus. But I just thank God. Hallelujah. I just thank God. Hallelujah. God of Rema. Hallelujah. Is Amen. And is our God. Amen. Because just to remain my God to Amen. the end of time. Amen. Amen. God bless you. I declare your testimony permanent. Amen. I agree with you that there will be no death anymore. Amen. The last barrier will be the last forever. Amen. The last barrier will be the last forever. Amen. The last barrier will be the last forever. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. It is done. God bless you. Thank you. God bless you. Wow. Wow. We give God all the glory. We give God all the glory. Father, thank you. Thank you for all the testimonies. Thank you for all the healings. Thank you, thank you for all the testimony. You, Hallelujah. Jesus. God is indeed a great God. Yes. Wonderful testimonies. Wow. Ah, Lord, wow. you are wonderful. Wow. It's wow. been an awesome moment on Experience Rema Water 
2024, a lot of people have called us in to share their testimony. As indeed, God is a great God. Mm. Wonderful testimonies. We yes. want to use this opportunity to thank our sponsor for as many who have been sponsoring this program. All Elijah Voice TV partners, partnering through Prophet Chinoso and Niebo. We want to say thank you to you for partnering with our Father to bring this program to a limelight. We want to bless the name of God upon your life and we pray that God of the Prophet will continue to bless and enrich your post in the name of Jesus. Amen. Sister Gift, do you have anything to say as we wrap up this program? Oh, yes. And we want to say thank you to all that have called us and you have shared your testimonies and your experience with Rema Water. We say may the Lord bless you and may the Lord continually give you bountiful testimonies. Amen. And to those of us that has been watching and listening, we are using this medium to invite you to our forthcoming Rema Water program, the June edition. It's starting on the 26th of June down to the 30th of June. Please prepare to attend. You have heard testimonies. It is not arranged. It is the testimonies of what God has done through Rema Water. Please make it a date this year and the Lord will surely grant you testimonies. Daddy, on a wrap up, what do you have to tell our viewers? Wow. I want to encourage everyone. First of all, I want to thank everyone of you, like Sister Gift have said, that called us, make our time to call us to share your experience. Your God will keep blessing you Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. And I want to encourage everyone to prepare for Rema Water program. And if you are coming from Leg outside Lagos State, you are coming from outside Nigeria, please let us know. Our our team have their they have our phone number displayed on the screen. You can contact us. You can let us know if you want for hotel reservation. You can let us know so that you'll be safe when you are coming for the Rema Water program. You have the sister that is all the way from Delta State. So stay it is not a barrier for you for being in Rema Water Program. Plan to attend and the Lord will bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. And one more time, those of you that we are not able to pick your call, please we apologize that we are not able to take your call because of our time and we are coming back again next month and the date will be displayed as well on the screen of next month when we shall come back and we expect by the time we resume back you will share your testimony with us. The Lord bless you. Amen. The Lord keep you. Amen. The Lord cause his face to shine on you. Amen. May God be gracious unto you. Amen. Every one of you who have listened to other people's testimony I declare you will testify. Amen. Everyone who have listened to Rema Water working for other people it will work for you. Amen. Wherever you are connecting from Nigeria, is any pain, any sickness, any challenges in your life, we declare deliverance in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. We declare healing in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. And so shall it be Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. My, my last word before we go off, I want to especially invite you to our Friday vigil on Friday, that is tomorrow, our vigil that is intense deliverance session, our vigil tomorrow, please be there by 10 p.m. And I assure you, because Jesus is the same yesterday, sure. today, and forever. Sure. If it is God, it will always, always, always be God. God bless, God bless, you. bless you. God bless you. Something great is happening in the city of Lagos this June. Our annual Rema Water Program 2024 is here with a team, Mighty God. Come and experience salvation, miracles, signs and wonders with unprecedented demonstration of God's power. Date Wednesday 26th to Sunday 30th June 2024. Time 8 a.m. Wednesday and Thursday, 10 p.m. on Friday, all night, and 8 a.m. on Sunday for the grand finale. Prayerfully plan and prepare to be part of this divine encounter. Don't miss it for any reason, as there will be no second edition this year, as we've had in previous years. Ministering, God's Messenger, Prophet Chinos of Favor and Abel. You will take Rema water and anoint your father's house. I saw something as I'm talking to you. And I saw something like before your father left village, he had an altar. Yes, 
sir. Like, yes, sir. I, like I yes. know he was. Yes, yes, sir. Yes. Sir. But when he was about relocating to Lagos, he abandoned it. Yes. That again, Wednesday 26 to Sunday 30th June 2024, at Elijah Faith Assembly behind the Sunday market of Aswani Mechanic Village of Osolowe, Isolo, Lagos. For inquiries and accommodation reservation, call or WhatsApp 080 340 91123 or 090 744 96550. Streaming live on Facebook and YouTube at Chinoso Enable and Elijah Voice TV. Remember, if it is good, it will always be good. Something great is happening in the city of Lagos this June. Our annual Rema Water Program 2024 is here with the team Mighty Good. Come and experience salvation. Miracles, signs and wonders with unprecedented demonstration of God's power. Date Wednesday 26 to Sunday 30 June 2024. Time 8 a.m. Wednesday and Thursday, 10 p.m. on Friday, all night, and 8 a.m. on Sunday for the grand finale. Prayerfully plan and prepare to be part of this divine encounter. Don't miss it for any reason, as there will be no second edition this year, as we've had in previous years. Ministering God's Messenger, Prophet Chino, so favor and able. You will take Rema water and anoint your father's house. I saw something as I'm talking to you now. I saw something like before your father left village, he had an altar. Yes, sir. Like, yes, sir. like I yes. do, he was. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, but sir. when he was about relocating to Lagos, he abandoned it. Yes. Date again, Wednesday 26 to Sunday 30th June 2024 at Elijah Faith Assembly behind the Sunday market of Aswani Mechanic Village of Osolowe, Isolo, Lagos. For inquiries and accommodation reservation, call or WhatsApp 080-340-91123 or 090-744-96550. Streaming live on Facebook and YouTube at Chinoso Enable and Elijah Voice TV. Remember, if it is good, it will always be good. Some